Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the PHP. So today we are going to learn about how to add a MailChimp sign up form to your website, any of your website, whether it's to be a WordPress, Magento or anyone else, how to add a MailChimp sign up form, right? So let's see how we are going to use it. So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment the video. Okay, so let's see how we are going to add MailChimp sign up form into your website. So first of all, if you have the MailChimp account, you can check how to create the MailChimp account in my previous video. Okay. So here we have the form builders, right? You can design your forms accordingly else you have the options. So I'm going to use the embedded forms or we have a sign up forms here. Let me check where it is. So we will create a sign up form over here. This contact form form integrations, create a sign up forms here using the one of integrations. Okay. So I'm going to select this part. And uh, we will use this uh, type form. Use this integration. No, we will we will use custom form, not this one. So let's go back and sign up forms. We will use the form builder. We will create the forms, right? And so we have a sign up form forms sign up forms okay and uh, let's subscriber pick email format plain or text html sign up form here okay now we are going to design it this email password that's okay phone number and the birthday okay that is okay and uh, design okay translate uh, there is any refer outer header build it fields are there you can add multiple fields from drag and drop here if you want the image you can drag it here to create the sign of forms okay and after this we have to where is embed here we have to go with the embed integrations no sign of forms This is embedded form, create form. Here you can just, this is basically if, uh, like subscribe newsletter. If you want to form fields, you can go and check the form fields. The email address, I want to add the first display name, first name, enable. First name is there, right? Let's enable the last name. Email address, first name, last name, okay? then continue and this is the embed code copy this code and go to your any of your HTML part so I'm going to use my where is my PHP part so here we have a MailChimp so there is index.php I'm going to create a new file open terminal uh, test.html sorry touch we have to add touch test.html so I have created this test.html. I'm going to open this file. I will going to add this file here, save this, and I'm going to run this file. Okay. So localhost php slash test pre mailchimp. I think right mail chimp is the, what the folder name is mailchimp test.html mailchimp slash test dot html okay so you can see that the form is there and i'm going to add the email address rajni 90 at the rate gmail.com i will add okay first name rajni khan okay so i'm going to sub submit this one okay thank you for subscribing okay now we will going to check this one this is added over here or not let's go and check this back to the edit back 
and the back again okay back again or you will go with this one so here we have the contacts right so the previous it was three now it's four okay so you can see that registry 90 registry and this so all the data from that form is coming out to the this part right so this is how you can use the sign up forms or you can create the sign up forms and uh, show embed that into your html or anywhere else whether it's a wordpress budget or anyone you can just add it and all the data would be uh, coming into the mailchimp part like this way so any doubt any query in that just let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video have a great day